The Sounders are on a roll, and once again, it's Nico Ladero leading the charge. That's next on this week's Scouting Report. Hi, I'm Matt Johnson, and welcome to this week's Quest Diagnostic Scouting Report. Good health starts with knowing. Well, you got to go all the way back to the Portland match in June to find the Sounders' last loss, and in that loss, Nico Ladero notched a couple of assists. That seems to have jump-started Seattle's number 10. During the eight-game unbeaten run, Nico's proven once again why he's so vital to this attack. Five goals and three assists are the numbers that you'll see, but it's his movement and vision that are making the offense click. He's averaged just under 90 touches per match, and his creativity and vision around the box has created opportunities that forces opponents to stay on their toes. And while other teams are forced to focus on him, his quickness opens up spaces for teammates like Gustav Raul and Harry Ship looking towards goal. Very similar to 2016 when Nico first appeared on the Seattle scene, as the season moves deeper into the schedule, Ladero seems to have more questions for the opposing defense. But that's just one side of the ball. We mentioned last week that Seattle lost five times earlier this year by a scoreline of 1-0. With the tandem of Ozzy Alonso and Gustav Svensson, opponents are lucky to get one past Stefan Fry. In this run of eight unbeaten, there have been four wins by a one goal margin. Since Alonso came into the match late in the first half versus Vancouver five games back and teamed up with Svensson in front of the back four, the Sounders have given up three goals while posting two shutouts. In Coach Schmetzer's post-game press conference after the win last week over FC Dallas, he pointed out that the two veterans complement each other perfectly in the middle of the park. They both have outstanding qualities, but it's their soccer IQ that has them meshing so well. You add Kim Ki-hee and Chad Marshall to the mix, and it's a formidable block of four that opponents are having trouble breaking down. With Nico on the front side, Ozzy and Gustav in the back, the Sounders are flying up the Western Conference table and looking to remain unbeaten in nine and a record six-game winning streak versus LA Galaxy. Since we are speaking scouting report, it's a bit tough to predict who comes up and plays for coach Ziggy Schmid. The Galaxy has lost just once in their last 12 MLS matches going 5-1-6, and six, but they have only one win in their last five. And their last two have taken a heavy toll on some frontline players. Jonathan Dos Santos, Giovanni Dos Santos, Roman Alessandrini, and Michael Ciani are highly questionable to appear this Saturday, and Zlatan Ibrahimovic's propensity for not playing on turf have Galaxy looking deep down their bench for this Western Conference showdown. We'll see you Saturday at CenturyLink Field at 1 p.m., or the game can be seen live on ESPN, YouTube TV, or on the radio on 950 KJR, or in Spanish on El Rey 1360.